寺みたいにみんなに見せ,見せて歩きたいなと思っています。This was the first game that allowed me to completely fulfill my musical vision. It defined my career, and the fans have been there e v e r y n c e To this day, it's one Everybody of my unfair. proudest works. The show us destiny to already. In June, Bungie revealed a new era of Destiny 2 that starts go, on November 10th with Beyond Light. For the first time ever, Guardians will add a new elemental power to their arsenal, the dark power of stasis. With stasis, players will take on the powers of darkness to control and dominate the battle. Here's an all new look at stasis from Destiny 2 Beyond Light. Let's go, people! Let's go! Gates are open. The darkness is here. As you step away from the light, we need only look inward. Focus your power. Let it grow. Our fight is far from over. The stranger, she sounds a bit weird. There we go. What up, Shade Bingo? Did it say Bingo? Warlocks get a fork that shoots ice a d u k e n s <laughs> Ooh, now that sniper looks pretty. Hunter's got the l e v e n e t We be throwing them f o e s and titan hammers when it looks at it. Oh, we got bank shutting knives. Nice. Beat him off the Titan. Boom. Boom. What's that like? A f o r s and feet of、uh, pan. Oh, you know what? It looks good. And that's what this, that's what this is. This is a subclass. Um. Kind of like a subclass teaser. That scares me. That actually scares me. Look pretty good, people. November 10th. Look pretty good. Now, I do want to talk about what I've just seen and what I will do is I'll replay the footage in the background now so you ain't watching the other BS. This, uh, Gamescom's gonna showcase. One more award to what give terrifies out tonight, me is, is best that. Sony、um, what scares me about them are, I mean, that was literally a, a teaser trailer for the new Stasis subclasses. What we saw in PvP there, I am, I am really hoping. When we've seen Guardians being thrown in his place, that to me, that needs to be a part of the, the super. That can't be a grenade. You can't be freezing enemies in place with a grenade. I mean, that will not go down well. I can see now. That has to be a super. I mean, we saw quite a few guardians there being frozen in place playing PvP. We don't know what. We like, didn't explain nothing there. Didn't give us no demonstrations into how these subclasses work, what they offer, this, that, and the other. As long as me as a hunter, I don't have a grenade, but I can throw at anybody, freeze them in place. That just will not go down. That, that sounds bad. It is bad. But、other than that, they look pretty cool. I mean, the weapons we saw there mostly look like reskins. The sniper looked pretty cool, but I'm pretty sure it's a reskin. But end of the day, we've been dealing with reskins since Destiny 1. Reskins don't bother nobody. As long as the weapons perform, who cares what they look like? To be honest. But yeah, they look pretty good, not gonna lie. You've probably seen it on screen now, going back over it. I'm watching some Ratchet and Clank crap on my screen. But yeah, it looked pretty good. I hope. To be honest, we get to see more of what this DLC will offer in terms of the destinations they are adding. 
the things they are taking away. I mean, there's a lot of things. I mean, if I don't know if you follow many other YouTubers, uh, Aztec, uh, Forbes covered his video where he goes into detail about what's happening with Destiny 2. Basically, it's going to be death. It's what Destiny 3 would be. And they're taking a lot of things away. 50% minimum of the game we are playing right now in Destiny 2, they are taking away. What they are adding, are they going to add that amount of content back into the game? Would this be on light? I'm not too sure, but I just hope. Do you know what they're doing? I really do, because darkness subclasses as great as they look. They ain't, they, they ain't enough. <laughs> that isn't enough. But we will see, people. We will see. I mean, it's early days yet. But yeah, people, I ain't gonna slate Bungie. End of the day, what we saw today was just basically a subclass teaser, so to speak. I mean, we saw footage of, was it within the Reckoning? We saw footage within a few PvP maps, uh, whatever. I mean, they ain't showcasing new spots, new places, new destinations. I mean, yes, like I said, a lot of things have been taken away. But at the end of the day, we don't know what they're bringing. It, I mean, you people know I'm in the biggest critic there is when it comes to Destiny 2. I will tell Bungie how it is straight up. I don't care. But at the end of the day, we weren't promised anything more than what we got right there. And what we got right there, what we saw was decent looking subclasses. We need new subclasses. I just hope they're customizable. They're taking away 50% of the content we have right now in game at minimum. 50% is quite a lot. Are they going to add that much back in? I don't think so straight away beyond light. But then refurbing water glass, which is going to come. Many other things from Destiny 1 are coming back. I mean, I'll take that, people. I will, I will take that. But all in all, mm, it looked pretty good. I mean, I ain't super excited about it. But at the end of the day, we've got a lot to learn. As of right now, we've got a lot to learn. I did hear a rumor about a stream that might come tomorrow. Uh, not sure how true that is, but we will see people. I mean, as you guys know, I don't cover every little bit of information like I used to do. Destiny 1, early Destiny 2 days. Now I just play the game for fun, post what I like, and that's the way I want to keep it, to be honest. But yes, I thought I'd bring you guys this video with my thoughts on what we saw today from Gamescom. Look pretty good. I ain't going to judge the DLC from what we saw today. I mean, yes, we saw a few reskinned weapons, a few reskinned armors. Uh, even subclasses looked a bit reskinned. But who cares? It's new shit. We know what we're playing with Destiny. We pay for the second game after the years we got with the first game. We can't complain. We're still playing it. We're still getting what we paid for. And we still enjoy it. End of the day. And that's what it is. But yeah, guys, tell me what you thought about down below in that comment section. Did it surprise you? Did it let you down? To me, I'm kind of in the middle. I mean, it's like, I'm, I'm probably left with more questions than answers watching that. But, but there's plenty of time to go before now and November 10th. So we will see, people. We will see what they drop details wise and on that note we have come to the end of the video if you guys enjoyed it leaving a like it really helps out if you're new around here and want to see more d2 be sure to subscribe but thanks as always for stopping by and hopefully i will see you on that next